Hello and welcome to my first YouTube Maths video. Today I want to show you a proof that actually isn't a proof. Um, it it says it says that two equals one, which isn't true. And I'm gonna tell you why this proof is wrong. Well, we get. We have the beginning here. It's fine. Here, a a plus a equals a plus x. When a equals x here, as we say in the beginning, let a equal x. And then we subtract 2x on both sides. We get 2a minus 2x equals a minus x, as this is the same. Um, and then we divide by a minus x and as you see here I've written it down already it is division by zero which is not allowed and then we would get 2 equals 1 but division by zero is not allowed um, if you divide by zero it just comes out as undefined you can read quite a lot on it on Wikipedia which gives a very nice explanation um, they say if you have 10 apples that need to be distributed um, and let's say five people yeah then everyone gets two apples well, if you have a basket with apples 10 apples and they have to be distributed but there's no one to distribute it to then it it's just undefined. It's it's wrong in the first case. So this proof isn't a proof, and I want to show you. There's quite a lot of them on the internet, um, which are the most of them are just this way. So um, you get two expressions, and then you divide them by zero or something that. Is zero but doesn't look like zero as a minus x doesn't look like zero and then you get let's say 2 equals 1 or 3 equals 2 or something like that I want to share another one with you which is also very typical I've got it from Wikipedia um, but also a friend of mine showed it to me before um, okay we get these two expressions, so x minus x in brackets times x equals x to the power of 2 minus x to the power of 2 which equals 0 <coughs> and then we get this expression um, which is a, a I mean x x minus x x to the power of 2 minus x to the power of 2 which equals 0 again and then we get um, then we say that this equals this as both of them equals 0 and then we get this expression and obviously um, we divide by 0 here again so we divide by x minus x which is 0 and then get x equals to x and in the final result after dividing by x we get 1 equals 2 which is not true yeah so this is what I wanted to show you thank you for listening I hope you after seeing this and if you believe in one of these proofs that you don't think that mathematics is stupid but that you start recognizing wrong proofs especially these uh, of this type that I've shown you where you divide by zero um, I hope you won't believe them next time. 
Thank you for listening and watching.